Okay guys, it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. In this tutorial, we will learn about how to make a 1 to 2 demultiplexer within the multisim. As we know that demultiplexer are the opposite or reverse of the multiplexers. In multiplexers, there are four input data lines while one output and in demultiplexer there is one data line and four data lines out so let's start our simulation for okay now first we will take our dc power supply then we need to take the ground Okay, now after it, we need to take our AND gate first. So, two input AND gate is enough for us. Okay, now we will take two switches two dip switches so we will go to like uh, switch and dip switch one okay so the first dip switch must be with the control bit and the second dip switch must be with the input so we will combine first two inputs of the end gates with each other and will connect it with the data line okay and we will connect it with the power supply and also the above switch with the power supply now we will take uh, our what's called is the dot gate so now we have two parts in this circuit one is the uh, control bit part and the other is the uh, data flow part like uh, switch one with this what's called as the not get it is the control bit with the help of this bit we can control both these and gates and what about okay now and this one the lower one is the uh, called as the data flow part so we can also use some indicators on the outputs like uh, some red some red color indicator so that we can zero or one okay now so this one is our okay so you can also make it like that and that Okay, now what about these inputs, inputs of the AND gate? First, we will connect it with the inverted AND, that is after the NOT gate and one before NOT gate. Okay, now this is our circuit and it is completed. We also need to reduce the voltage to 5 volts. For better, uh, because for better tolerance, because uh, semiconductors are not supposed to tolerate uh, about like 12 volts so it is better to use 5 volts now we will run it it can take 5 to 6 seconds even so we can wait for a while Okay, now our simulation is running. Now, whenever we will press this data switch, we can see that our data is on the first output. Okay, and when we will press the switch, then our data is flowing or being demultiplexed to the second output. So, hopefully, you got the concept. 
of making 1 to 2 D multiplexer within the multi-SIM. So thanks for visiting our channel.